Here's the size of the 10.4 inch raw panel. This is the Pile 10.4 inch. It looks identical to the Roadmate one on the website. It comes even with the same remotes. It comes with these 5 cent remotes. Uh, what's neat with this one is it has a wireless remote and it also has a, a wired remote. Here's the remote that's wired in so that you don't have to use the IR sensor ever. So I have this powered up. I have my video, trans, uh, video receiver. That's the black unit right there. Hooked up to power. And the screen itself hooked up the power to some 12 volt gel cells I have. I could have used one, but I'm lazy and didn't bother wiring it. Um, then here's a transmitter. So the, the receiver is receiving static right now, but the screen is showing blue. So I have to get some sort of um, whatever it's called, the VGA converter. I don't know. That seems to make it show snow. Here's the case. That's the size of the um, bezel, screen bezel. It's inside its foam right now. It's paintable comes white so it's going to sit about that big inside my Pelican 1450 case. I have my three cell lithium battery powering the transmitter which is going to be getting warm so I turn on the camera the GoPro and now it's transmitting video. So there. As I move the camera around it's uh, picking up the video. So there's the video quality. It's very good actually. I don't know if my cell phone camera picks it up very well, but I mean, you can certainly, if I go up beside the battery here, oh, I'm on the wrong side of the battery. Come on. I go up beside the battery. You can certainly read what the battery says on it through the GoPro, through transmitting. See, the GoPro transmits um, widescreen, so my 4x3 screen that I have here isn't. Uh, no, it's doing it's doing what it needs to, but it's got the black bars on it at the top and the bottom, which that kind of sucks. But the on screen, the camera on screen is here, so it kind of makes sense. You have all your main video there. Your on screen is not blocking anything. But I wouldn't mind having full screen. There's a mode button here, and you press it, and that's what happens. Nothing. Nothing happens. So, oh well, I was hoping I'd get some sort of pan and scan versus zoom scan and all that sort of stuff. But the screen's beautiful. It's a lot heavier for two pounds than I expected. It feels more like five pounds to me. I haven't weighed it. But uh, that's that. So, very exciting. So now I have my FPV screen. And it's just a panel. It's just a panel. There's, not even, there's no buttons on it. There's no speakers on it. There's nothing but just an LCD screen. Very exciting.